This story has been floating around for the last few days, and if you haven't seen it, I'm about to break it down for you. The story is of a wholesome man that just simply wanted to own a store, a Star Wars store in Washington. This simple wholesome man put a simple wholesome sign up, and to some, this sign may have been offensive. So, a city council member decided to visit this wholesome man's store and berate him on camera for views and outrage. So this video surfaced a few days. Elijah Schaefer shared it out, and that's how I saw it. Also, Data Racer out there, we're going to be talking about him. He, like, dug into this and really got in there, doing the, doing the Lord's work over there, Data Racer. You know, without any context other than what I already gave you, I'm just going to play the video and just let me know what you guys think of this video. Here we go. I'm going to put the cans on. Cha. You're gonna you're gonna put that up and you're gonna let everybody else see it. Well, everybody but when loves you're confronted it. by a trans woman, you're Every, gonna hide it. Everybody loves it. This is a this is a woman, by the way. This six foot eight. It's a woman. No, they I don't take think pictures so. of it. They post it. Uh huh. Nine out of ten customers love it. Yeah, you know what? It's bullshit. That actually no, tracks with uh, stats. Uh, no, it's not. <laughs> Trans it is... women are women, sir. That sign is bullshit. I'll tell you what. Just check it out. It ain't bullshit. I'm no way, hey. Here's the sign, actually. Just out. Dr. Seuss's new book. If you're born with a dick, you're not a chick. <laughs> Period. Come on. Come on. In fact, now he should actually get some graphic design, put that sign together, and get a big-ass fucking poster made. Now, as a trans woman, trans women are women. Well, I'm telling bullshit. you, as a man, that's bullshit. Uh -huh. <laughs> it is, it's total bullshit. Okay. You know what? Nobody confronts your ass. That's the problem. Yeah. Really? If they'd say, really? What the? You want to bet? What the fuck? You want to bet? Yes, I will bet. You made it all the way to city council. Nobody confronted your ass. In fact, you actually were voted in as a man. And then decided, oh, now I'm going to transition to being a woman. And now you have to accept me. And now I'm going to go around and harass members of the fucking city and attempt to get them shut down. Attempt to cancel them in real life as a city council person. You're fucked in the head. Do you know, what, have do you know how many there? people you've embarrassed at, oh, at wow. City Hall? Me embarrassment there have to, to City Hall? There have really to yes. tolerate that shit. shit. City, sir. You are an embarrassment to this city. I am a pillar in the city. Everybody knows. I'm a he is a pillar of the city. He owns a business. He contributes to the city. What the f do you do, councilwoman? What do you actually do for the city? He actually has a business that contributes to the economy of the city. He is a pillar of the city. You're a leech. A pillar in this. Now, oh, you yeah. do that. Do you know why? Every time some bullshit like this happens. Uh -huh. My sales go up because people are wanting this. Really? Go find really? his store really? and buy everything you can. You do it. You do it. You do it really good. Because guess hopefully what? Hopefully we can wake you up. You are fucking nuts. Let's wake you up. You <laughs> are <laughs> nuts. Sir. You're not a woman. You don't look like a woman. Uh -huh. You don't act like a woman. Really? Oh, by the way, this is what she looks like. I'll just let you, you know. Come to your own conclusions there. You're fucked really? in the head. What's wrong really? with you? I'm fucked in the head. I am, I am confronting you yes, sir. that you are an asshole. And I'm confronting you that just because I walked into your store, you felt the need to take your sign down. Well, I, I, was, I, was car, thinking I, I was thinking I was going to uh, uh, be nice. Much, but no. Be nice? Be nice? Putting that sign up is not being nice. Putting that sign up is fucked up. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to put it on my TV out front. Good. Go for it. <laughs> do you know why? Well, everybody you know why? before they walk in. Why did they uh, cancel Dr. Seuss? No reason at Nobody all. Nobody canceled Dr. No. Seuss. There are tons of his books still out there. But the one. But Dr. Why? Seuss himself said those books were racist, and he was ashamed of them. And so they took them off. He... Let me let me yes, tell you this. Took them off you they are were wrong. you are fucked in the head. You really? Know, people are thinking you are fucking nuts. You know what? That's great. Because That's I'm great. Me. I'm living my life the way I want to live it. 
I'm living my life. I'm going into your store. I'm living my life harassing you, bringing somebody in with a camera and trying to cancel you and have protests, tagging celebrities like George Takai and Mark Hamill, trying to get you publicly shamed for having a sign in your own store. I'm living my life. Fuck you. No, you're not. You're disgusting. You're using your power, your city council power. You think you're better than he is. Then you're going to try and use your LGBT whatever the fuck status to then publicly shame a U.S. veteran, a U.S. Vietnam veteran. Fuck you. You should be stripped of all duties. You're disgusting. Not because you're a trans woman, because you're a fucking shitty person. You're a shit person. You're fucked in the head. Again, clarify, not because you're trans, because you're a shitty person. Just thought I'd say that again. Just so the YouTube people know exactly where I'm standing. It's not because she's trans. It's because they're an asshole. Trans women are oh, women. Jesus Christ, man. Get a clue. Trans women Get are up. women. Get a Trans women are women. Nobody around to hear this shit. Because you know what? Women. They're afraid they're gonna hurt your fucking Trans women are women! I'm gonna be out here all the time. What do you do? You get well, away from well, why aren't you doing your council woman duties? I am out of your store. You're get nuts. the fuck away. No, from no, this is the front. It doesn't matter. This is the city. You get away from me. I have you to get away from you, sir. I'm not gonna get away. I'm confronting your ass because you're nuts. That's fine, you're confronting you. I'm good. Leave. I'm out of your store. Leave. You leave. You leave. leave his own store? I'm here. I'm out of your store. What more do you want? Let me ask you. Let me ask you a question again. Do you have a dick? You don't have a dick. I'll bet you do. <laughs> Let me ask you. Do you have a dick? <laughs> I fucking love this guy. God. What are you? You are a fucking idiot. What are you? Both, both sides of the fence. <laughs> <laughs> You're a fucking dude. <laughs> hey, this councilwoman brought this on herself. She decided to go into somebody's store and harass them with a camera. They got the they got what they they wanted. They got what they wanted. I don't care. I hope so. Good. Because I want to be in your fucking face because nobody really? confronts your fucking really? stupid ass. Really? That's right. Really? You should for Christ's sake. You nuts. I can't hear shit. Not an idiot getting up in my face talking about shit they know nothing about. Not an idiot getting up in my face up in my face you walked your wobbly ass into his store and then you complain about him getting up in your face bitch leave walk away you are a fucking bigot <laughs> Okay. Thank you. You're gonna lose my business completely. All right. Good. I hope so. Bye. Yeah. Because this is leave. There's nothing wrong with her. She's not doing anything. She's minding her own but business. I She's minding her own business? <laughs> She's my bitch! Leave! Who the fuck are you, you third party whore? Leave! You know nothing. Minding her own business. No, in fact, she's trying to mind his business. <laughs> And he's got a dick. <laughs> <laughs> so, the little bit of that news broke, and the media, of course, sided with the councilwoman and went back to interview him and got this just, just nugget of gold. So let's hear that. And some people think it's hurtful. Well, they told us that this hurt. But here's the thing. I don't give <laughs> about feelings anymore. I'm 70 <laughs> m age. I went to Vietnam to fight for all this. Hell yeah. Do you think I care about some feelings? Absolutely not. That's what I'm fucking talking about. Here's the thing. I don't give a shit. 
thank you for your service. You are a treasure. You're a Chad. They're, they're already trying to cancel him, get his business shut down, protest. <laughs> what the fuck? But if you're in the Aberdeen, Washington area, go find Don Suker. Tell him, welcome home. Thank you for your service and buy some stuff in his shop. Give him support. He's the sane one in this instance, okay? The world has gone crazy around this man and he's sitting there being a normal person. Now he's getting harassed for it. Go support him. I hope he does great. In fact, I hope he moves out of Washington because they don't fucking deserve him. Move somewhere that appreciates you. And to the councilwoman, Fuck you. You're a despicable person. Not because you're a trans woman, because you're an asshole. Hit like, subscribe, and uh, do all those diddly bits. And hey, get, uh, look in the description. There might be a little something, a little hiding down there. A little link. A little, uh, you know, a little hunt, hunt, hunt link. See you next time. I'll see y'all in Vegas, baby. Vegas. What you wouldn't read about is how Liza Maria Meskis who lost his mind was committed to a mental hospital only to escape and join the police force under the assumed identity of a missing hiker manipulating his way to the top in a diabolical scheme to get even with Dan Marino whom he blamed for the entire thing. <laughs> She's not Liza Maria Meskis. She's Ray Finkel. She's a man. He's lying.